Hello YouTube and welcome to World of Tanks. Today I'm going to show you a little bit about uh, one of my all-time favorite games and what I've been playing the most lately. Uh, uh, I can, I tried to uh, make more of, I actually did more Minecraft episodes, but my computer crashed and I'm having, to, I played this on my laptop, so it might not be very uh, speedy. As you can see, uh, the quality is not very good either. The actual game is way better if you have a decent computer. Uh, so, what I want to show you today, this is actually a double feature. I'm showing you my SU-122-44, which is the new uh, coming, which came in 8.1, new Russian uh, premium tank destroyer, tier 7. And I, I can say that it is a beast. This is an awesome tank destroyer. Uh, I had I had uh, great games with it, and uh, this is one of them. Excuse me again for the frame rate, because uh, yeah, this is not the greatest of computers. I actually I'm playing in uh, 124 by 6768, <laughs> and uh, I'm recording this at the normal resolution, which makes it a bit slower. And the second thing I want to show is Dragon Dragon Ridge. If you have played World of Tanks for quite for a bit, you might recognize this map. It has been it has been taken out of circulation in the random matches, but now it's back when with a couple of changes. So here we are. We're gonna help uh, our friend Tiger Two here. Uh, I'm actually, yeah, I'm right now. I'm looking at those guys over there, but now I decide to help my Tiger Two friend. So let's see what I see. Go have a sniper view. Oh, this is awful. Aim on the low E, and it went too low. Hit the tracks, and his tracks ate the shell. Here we go again. Here goes the VK, and boom! Right in the lower plates. Once 107 damage, and he's dead. This gun is awesome. It has very good, uh, well, good penetration. Uh, I take a hit there from the M26. And it has great alpha, as you're about to see, or as, uh, wait, as you are not about to see, because uh, apparently I missed. But uh, okay, let's back up a little bit. I, you can see I got some bounces there. This, let me show you. This uh, it has very good frontal armor, but look at the slope on that thing. It's crazy slope. You can see the marks where they tried to hit me but couldn't. Here, here, there. It's crazy. Let's see what I'm looking at now. Tiger. Okay, not interesting. And coming out to play. Oh, there's a T25 too. Now look at this. Look at this. Look at this alpha. Boom! 407 damage. And look at the reload speed of that thing. It's beautiful. Again, 370. Very lucky because the random the RNG didn't look quite uh, help me right there. Could have killed him. Did not. So let's see what's going on here. Type 59. Good thing to take this, these guys out of the game pretty soon. But uh, I hit the turret. The turret's very well sloped, so it's not going to do much. There it goes. I'm reloaded again. I'm ready to go with a crazy good. Oh, and what is <laughs> He's going for a little bit of an off road driving. Tried to lead him, failed. And there he goes again, and now he's his downfall. Oh, look at there. He tracked himself. Boom! 399 damage. And one more shot, one more shot again. Kill! Boom! Man, he's dead. Two kills already. I know you must be almost cringing at this frame rate. <laughs> again, I apologize. Not much I can do. And oh, 443 damage. You see the alpha on this thing is amazing. And look at the reload speed. Damn you, turret! Oh, and a Type 59 and a Dicker Max. Dicker Max is very good alpha, and uh, he's almost dead, so I take him out quickly before the th that Type 59 gets to me. And there he is. He hits me in the track. My track eats the shell, and he goes back into hiding. I bounce one of him, and boom! 381. He also damaged me, but I damage him back. And now he's back for more, and he bounces. And he goes into hiding, that pesky little guy. So now we're... <laughs> and this is the start of... Uh, we're, we're, uh, you can see I have one shell left. I have been only using AP rounds. 
I have not been using any uh, gold rounds now in 8.1. You can buy them with credits, and you can see I loaded 15 of, the, of them, but I have not used a single one yet. And I, I won't use any gold rounds in this replay, or in fact, I might not use uh, in any future replays, but I can't guarantee you that because they're really useful to penetrate those higher tier. So you can see now, it's a matter of who gets who first. The Type 59 is at 633. Oh, and he takes a very bad damage. And I know he sighted in on me. He's just waiting for me to come. Oh, that was close. He's just waiting for me to peek out and blast me away. I can actually take one of one hit. And uh, in hindsight, I should have gone and uh, face hugged him. But uh, I was also concerned about the other guy that just barely missed me. So he, he's trying to go around me. You can see the, tri the traverse, traverse speed is just terrific. It, he's not going to be able to circle, circle me anytime soon. And there he goes. I can't, I can't reach him. Too bad gun depression. And I take this chance. Can I hit him? Can I? Can I? No, I don't. And come on. Oh, and he kills me. Good shooting, man. Good shooting. I should have face hugged him or face hugged him earlier. So let's see how we, we're doing here. As you can see, we're we are now capturing the enemy base. And uh, yeah, you shouldn't have pushed that thing. It's quite useful, actually. Now, uh, there's something that bothers me, and that is... Oh, there he goes. <laughs> there's, a, there's the chat. And uh, I compliment him, nice shooting, because that was quite a nice shooting. And we're gonna cap. There's no, there's no chance we can lose now. So, three kills, great game. I uh, have the end plates, and I'm gonna post them after the video so you can see them. So, there we go. Enemy base capture. That's our cue for winning the game. And there we go. So the replay is now complete. Uh, but I want to give you some uh, overall impressions on the TD. First of all, it's awesome. It's very, very good. And uh, I, I'm kind of surprised because the, the, uh, the method for which they have been releasing uh, premium tanks up until now was that they are better than stock tanks of the same tier but worse than elite tanks of the same tier. This doesn't appear to, appear to be the case with the, the SU-12244. His counterpart is the, is the SU-152 which, which is the Russian tier 7 tank destroyer of the first line and uh, it's the one I am I'm currently grinding actually and uh, it, this this tank is way better than, than the SU-152 so I thought that's, that's kinda odd and good at the same time it's also uh, relatively cheap at 6,750 6, gold if I'm not mistaken and uh, so it's a great value for what you're getting very good uh, slope frontal armor very good traverse not a lot of uh, gun sway, which is kind of annoying. Of course, as it's not an American tank, uh, it's a Russian tank, it's not going to have very good gun depression. Extremely good alpha. I mean, it's, it's uh, I'd say, tier 8 alpha. Tier, there's actually a couple of tier 10 tanks which have the same alpha as this gun. And it has very good penetration for its tier with gold rounds it absolutely wrecks face he just punches the faces right in doesn't even give him a chance and uh... it's very mobile you can see uh, I, I managed to to get around very quickly so it's what can i say it's one of the best premium tanks around if not the best of course it's not a tier eight it's not gonna make as much credits as a tier eight but uh, it's way cheaper than a tier 8, except the super version, which is another awesome tank, which is very misunderstood by the general population, but I, I enjoy a lot. And uh, 
Let me see what else. What else can I say about this, this tank? Uh, and yeah, it's a lot of people calling for a nerf on it. And I, no, don't nerf my tank. It's cool. I like it. <laughs> yeah, but it's. Uh, I feel that it's. It might be a little, just a teeny bit overpowered. Just a teeny bit. Just a nitty bit. So maybe, maybe, maybe nerf the gun reload time because oh, that's that's not another thing I, I forgot. The gun reload time on this thing is insane. You saw it. You know it. With a 100% crew, which is what I have here, vents, which is what I have here, it just absolutely wrecks face. And with the bro uh, bro brothers in arm, where really I can speak, which I don't have, I actually put camo on it, and I'm, I'm now actually regretting it. Uh, it turns just into a beast, which has under 7 seconds of reload time. Which is, come on, 7 seconds reload time. That is ridiculous. That is just ridiculous. With this high alpha, this penetration, and this short reload time, this is a tank which you just... It's very hard to go wrong with this tank. Of course, as it's a TD, it has a different playstyle uh, than most of the tankers are used to. But, 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 but... I love it. You can see over there I had 2,469 damage, which is cool, very cool, because I have 840 uh, hit points, which means I did about uh, three times my my hit points in damage, which for tank destroyer is just about a little over sweet spot, little not sweet spot, a little a little over the recommended damage. Uh, for TDs, I usually go for two and a half times your hit points and damage to three, which is what I got here. And that's it. Dragon's Ridge, very cool. I love love seeing this map again. It's very very beautiful, very scenic, and uh, it's been vastly changed for 8.1 with the phys for 8.0 with the physics. And uh, I don't think there's anything else I can say. So. Yeah, and I hope this will be my new series on the world of tanks. I just have to get a better microphone because I'm recording this on my laptop so you can hear the annoying fan in the background. <laughs> and I'm going to try to get that off with editing. Or maybe not because it's 1.25 in the morning and I'm pretty lazy. Alright, tankers, guys, ponies, bronies... Pegasus, whoever is watching this, have a good night. And also, if you don't, play World of Tanks. Seriously, it's tanks. You can't go wrong with tanks. It's freaking tanks. You run around and you blow up stuff. There's hardly any greater joy in life then running around blowing up stuff. So join World of Tanks. WorldofTanks.com, I'm gonna post a link in the description down below. So look at it and join us. Hey, hello you guys! Uh, I'm doing a voiceover because I actually forgot to tell you something. If, if I can get 50 comments on this video, I'm gonna give out to one lucky commenter randomly an invite code to World of Tanks which you can use to create your new account and it will give you 1,000 gold, which is usually you, you have to pay money for, and 3 days premium accounts, which lets you gain 50% more credits and experience uh, for every match you play, which is pretty good and will help you get started. So, uh, share this video with your friends, and if we can, we can get 50 comments, I'm gonna give out this code one random uh, lucky commenter so uh, I guess that's pretty much it hope you enjoyed this video and Astro Pony aka Never Wish if you want to meet if you want to find me in game that's my name Never Wish so Never Wish signing out